So I was able to fix the mold. Um, I put some vinegar on her face and it's actually going to kill the mold so it'll be gone. Now the only thing I need to do is do an acne cream treatment to get rid of these little stains that are on her cheek here. And then she will be as good as new. And I will be able to keep her, which is good. And I'm going to show you the box in this video, just so if you guys were curious about her box. She has this blue backdrop in her box. And then she comes with this lid that says goats on the side and goats on the other side. And then it has like a little ribbon across the front and it says goats. And it has like a little window. And this is her box that she came in. So she came in this little box, and I believe this is her original box, because I'll show you, it says on the back that she was made in 1989, is when she was gifted to someone for Christmas, I think. Let me look. I don't know. First doll. So I don't know if it was for Christmas or birthday or something. But she was somebody's first doll, and that's really sweet. Um, so she was somebody's first doll, and that's a really sweet thing. She's very cute. So, this was somebody's first doll in 1989. So what a sweet little doll, isn't she? But she's from 1989. And look at her. She's what they call an American Girl prototype. Which means she was made during nineteen nineteen during the early nine early eighties. So they made these to look similar to the American girls. Now this one is what they call the rejected prototype because this one they did not Pleasant Company did not buy the mold. Um, Dolls by Renee bought this mold, but it has a similar look to the Romina doll. So I consider her a prototype because of that reason. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And the top of her dress is actually soaking right now. So I'm just showing you what the bottom of her dress looks like. And she also has these cute little bloomers here. And then she has these cute little shoes. She is very cute. Um, I'm very happy with her. And I'm just surprised that I got this doll for free because of the mold issue. So I will be getting a refund for her, and I will be able to buy something else now, which will be fun. So when I get the refund, I'm probably going to be ordering something else for my doll collection. But I am pretty pleased with this doll. So because she is a prototype, she was a really good deal, and I'm very pleased. Um, I was very pleased with the price, so... Overall, getting her for free was wonderful. Um, the mold issue, I can handle it. So I can handle a little bit of TLC for a free doll. You know, it's not a big deal. But she does have a little bit of a stain on one bow. I'm not probably going to deal with that. But I am dealing with the stains on her top part of her dress. And I'm going to try to make her look as good as possible. Because she's going to be a collectible someday. And I will see you guys next time. Bye now. <laughs>